हेलो नमस्ते सलाम वालेकुम शास्त्रीय काल वेलकम बैक टू अनदर सेशन विथ योर वॉश ऑफ एट वार एवा डॉट कॉम टूडे वी गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू मेक खोया चिकन कोरमा इट्स नॉट दैट खोया गया चिकन दिस इज रियल मिल्क खोया चिकन सो डियर फ्रेंड्स टूडे वी गोइंग टू मेक ए नाइस स्टफिंग विद चिकन ब्रेस्ट हियर आई हैव गॉट द चिकन ब्रेस्ट एंड स्लिट ओपन सो दैट आई कैन स्टफ इन साइड फॉर दिस आई एम गोइंग टू टेक खोया that is uh, condensed milk you know we make this uh, awesome khoya with uh, milk and in this we're going to add the pistachio and we also going to add some grated paneer you know this paneer will balance out the uh, mixture and in this add lot of uh, chopped mint and you can make it spicy by adding some chili flakes shahi jeera some chopped uh, coriander and salt and add pinch of garam masala now we going to mix this mixture and we going to stuff this mixture inside a chicken breast take this chicken breast and put the stuffing inside this chicken breast okay bring this edges in together and press it nicely so that all the stuffing goes inside and uh, settles inside now we going to put this chicken breast into a hot griddle or even you can cook in the oven or i am going to do pan fry the chicken is all stuffed but we need to make a nice awesome korma gravy so first let's learn how to make this korma gravy this almond melon seeds cashew nut and poppy seeds <clears throat> you need to let this boil for at least 15 minutes that is when even the poppy seeds become slightly soft and you will be able to put in the blender and make into a fine paste put in a blender along with fried onions we have this uh, paste ready when this uh, garam masala sizzles we going to add some cumin seeds add ginger garlic paste in this we going to add tomato puree now once this is cooked we going to add this paste of nuts in this add one full teaspoon of uh, coriander powder half a teaspoon of uh, cumin powder turmeric always add in the oil now in this half a teaspoon of chili powder now just uh, mix all of this this looks good we even before this comes to a boil we are going to add just you know 2 3 tablespoon of curd beaten curd once it comes to boil the curd may curd a little bit so add it in this now after around 25 minutes of cooking you see that uh, this gravy has nicely thickened and look at the color wow now that the korma gravy is ready add some oil in a pan not too much and you know take this chicken breast and put it in the hot oil and uh, you know just we going to cook this both sides the chicken is uh, nicely cooked now we going to pour the korma gravy on top and also we going to add some water because we going to let this cook for almost you know 10 minutes on a slow flame and by the time the chicken is cooked all the gravy also will become thick you know after cooking for almost uh, you know 12 to 14 minutes look at this this is perfectly cooked as i told you the chicken breast slightly shrunk but this is perfectly cooked inside outside so dear friends you know what we going to do switch off the flame and what they do in the restaurants is they when they make a nice stuffing like this they they cut this chicken breast into a sliced to show the nice stuffing inside so look at this chopping board i have made sure that i sanitize the chopping board before i put the chicken because this is going directly onto the plate then just saw the chicken and when this opens you will have to see the stuffing that is inside wow and they present it so good and when you see the plate itself you will be like wowed so i'm going to put this on a plate you know look at this chicken you know the way it is stuffed and the way it is cooked and the way it is presented i'm telling you this is so piping hot but this is how you need to eat this ha huh. mm. mm 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 you know dear friends it is not always that you make special dishes like this 
to eat these dishes you may have to pay a lot of money in a specialty gourmet kind of restaurants but you have seen how simple it is you can make this and on a romantic evening make it for your partner and i'm telling you they will be so impressed wow hmm the inside stuffing of koya you know grated paneer wow hmm dear friends i hope you enjoyed today's session of learning how to make this koya chicken korma but do not forget vareva is all about inspiring others to cook so please post your recipes and cooking tips at vareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking thank you